Now that we've defined the eight deadly wastes, let's look at a video that could happen in your kitchen or at your workstation. Our customer has ordered eight freshly baked chocolate frosted chocolate cupcakes. Our company has established the cost of each cupcake based on our current process to manufacture the cupcake or product. We have some clear instructions calling for three distinct materials, premixed flour and cocoa, two eggs and oil. For some reason, the supply technician forgot about 6S and provided too many materials to the workstation. The assembler in the kitchen workstation, Anna, sorted only the ones she needed. However, in the process of sorting, she made a mess with the flour and spread the materials all over the workstation. Wasted time and energy of moving goods around in an is an example of transportation waste. Once she started assembling, she had to reach for things and this created motion waste. The scheduler had a co-worker assigned to the work cell and he wasn't doing anything of value in the process and created employee underutilization waste. Remember the goal of Lean is to create value for the customer. Do you think the customer is willing to pay for the cost of this employee doing nothing of value in our process? The assistant could have been utilized to spray the non-stick grease onto the cupcake tray, which was the next step in the process. After that, the process called for the baking of the cupcake mix in the oven for 12 minutes. The assembler or the assistant could have been cleaning up the eggshells and washing the mixing bowl. Instead, they took an unscheduled break and played Angry Birds on their iPad. This is another example of employee underutilization waste. When the cupcakes came out of the oven, the assembler started using a metal knife to wedge the cupcakes out of the tray, one by one. The cupcake tray was getting scratched and damaged and she was creating over-processing waste. The tray had been sprayed with nonstick grease to save the step. Remember when we said all we needed was three materials? Well, we were wrong. The customer had asked us for eight freshly baked chocolate frosted chocolate cupcakes. Where's the frosting? The material handler's pre-staging error created waiting waste for the assembler. By the time her assistant finally got back to the workstation with the frosting, the assembler was under pressure to not miss the promised customer delivery date. This created defect waste. In the end, the company produced 12 cupcakes. One got scrapped since it could not be reworked, and eight got sold. Three were left to go stale in the inventory due to overproduction waste. Now that we've identified all the waste, we have to eliminate it from the value chain with the goal of creating value for the customer. What feedback can you give Anna to make her process better?